once again with the one time star of an old movie, 1980, or correction, 1990, Firebird. So this is a uh, uh, Saab Draken. And uh, this was made from molds. Of the jet that was used in the movie, the RC jet. So. Those new battery this one's gonna be a lot better, I think. I mean not much heavier. It's looking really scale. We'll do a downward pass. Definitely feels a little better than the last CG setting. Good. I'm back off the power right now. I'm Brent over half the power. There's Roger. Builder. There's Brent pilot. Almost sounds like a turbine. Yeah, it's got a really nice sound to it. Nice job of the ducting, huh? Gee whiz. That's a phone, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. That's somebody's phone. <laughs> God. Nicely done. Yeah, uh, really wow. That was right at four minutes. So, yeah, a yeah, little over four minutes, Brent. Wow, super duper job. So we're just out here at Rabbit Dry Lake oh, with a, another house. piece of uh, jet RC history. We have the uh, while back we had the nitro powered kefir, and then now we have the electric. Uh, Saab Draken made from plugs that were used for the, to make the jet featured in the 1990 Nicolas Cage movie Firebirds. So, more RC history. Alright, hey, good job, Brent, yet again, as usual. Um, 
yes. So we like to feature interesting jets, interesting planes, interesting everything here and just wing it. And this is most certainly one of them. This again is a Is it me, Brent, or does it seem a little faster that time? Yeah, yeah this yeah, thing's moving. In the morning, the cold air this is a, again a fairly rare plane. Uh, made from molds that were utilized to make well, the plane that was featured in the RC plane. Well, I had featured in the 99 movies Firebird. So again, hey, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for subscribing. Uh, we're out here at a, a pretty busy uh, Saturday out here at Rabbit Dry Lake. So I wish you all the best and happy landings from Just Wayne.